won't be re reviewing the link website and I'll tell y'all if it's worth it. So let's get into it. So here's what you see when you first log into the link website. You have the home page, all the languages they offer, and a lot more information that I never read. So let's log in and see what you get. Okay, so after you log in, this will be the page that you see. You have the library tab, my lessons tab, vocabulary tab, playlist tab, and at the top you have lessons, tutor, and community. So I'm just going to show y'all what you get in each of these tabs or what's on the, each of these tabs. So the library tab is just content that has been uploaded by either link website users or link the link team itself. So lesson feed is by the user and guided courses are by the link team members. You can also search for what you want by category. So you can see all these categories right here and lesson store these are lessons that you can purchase with coins that are free from the link website after you complete a few lessons the lessons so i'm going to show you how these work let me just pull up a lesson here so basically these are how all the lessons look um they have audio up here not every lesson has audio but for the ones that do it will be up here with this blue play button all the words in white are the words that you already know and words in yellow are words that you came across but you you felt like you didn't know them and words in blue are words that you have never seen before so for example when you click on the word it'll come up with the what how what how you pronounce it and the and the definition and this little scale right here is a scale that you set by yourself you you pick specifically for that word how well you think you remember it so the these are the different levels the higher the number the better you remember the word so let's say i put this at a three so the word would become less yellow until it got to known until i physically moved it to known and blue words are words like like i said that you never came across in the text and i have a free free account right now so but normally what would happen is you would click the word and it would come up with different definitions and then you would select from those definitions the best one that fit in that context so let's say you know you know this word you can just get past it and it will automatically save and turn into white so the my lesson tab are lessons that you have opened from the link library or lessons that you have uploaded by yourself to this website um i usually upload news articles and books to read i don't really use the content that's already on here vocabulary tab are all the words that you have saved and you can make flashcards with it uh you can review your words huh. or things like that I personally do not review any of my words on here, but yeah, you have that option if you're into flashcards and space repetition system, because that's what this is. Um, you can also save phrases from the text that you read. I currently have 705 saved. And these right here are what the website thinks you should review. So that's why it says do for you right here. And 11,300 terms, I'm never going to get through that, which is why I never, why, which is why I don't do them. So let's go to the tutor tab. Um, everything is built into this website. You can have tutors on here too for different prices. I personally use italki to do my tutoring, uh, when I decide to do that, um, you can also submit your writing to these tutors for it to be corrected let's say you have a paper or a story you want corrected they'll also do that and you 
can see the pricing pricing right here. So let's go to the community tab. Community tab is just a place where people just talk about anything, ask questions about the website, languages. If they have problems, somebody will come and help them. Like you can see right here, just a way to interact with fellow link members on here. Challenges. I Here's all the challenges that, that is going on right now. I personally did a few, but after a while, I felt like it was no point in me doing them because, yeah, sometimes people cheat and just go scroll through the stories and things like that. But anyway, let's get back to the point. Yeah, it's a lot of different challenges. It's usually a new challenges every month. A new challenge every month. You have the write in exchange where you can either correct people writing or you can submit your own writing. And this is a free feature right here, but it's corrected by other members on this site. Let me show y'all my statistics. I'm going to show y'all over here. If I had a streak, it would it would be right here. I have to make at least 13 links per day. And the longest streak I had was for about six months, but I'll let that go. And the reason my statistics are so low, as you can see right here, is because I have been I have been um preferring to read in person read with physical books and read uh, news articles off the site so as you can see i was most active from from may up until july up until august um the summer months where i only had a job and not a lot of responsibilities but i have then since fallen off but anyway i have 26,300 uh known words 50 15,000 links or save words and 535,000 uh, words of reading. And that's just on this website. Um, of course I read offline and of course I read offline with physical books and stuff. So that's why my numbers are so low. So here are my achievements right here. It has 26,000 known words, things like that. And currently I'm at the advanced one level on the website. Right here you have uh, video tutorials on how to use link and also Steve Kaufman's link, uh, I mean tips for learning a language and these are also videos um, that are on his YouTube channel, channel. So here's the price in $12.99 a month and then you have all these other prices. Um, you don't actually pay these prices at the top right here. These are one payment options. So basically you would be paying the price down here, but it would become a breakdown of this up here. So it looks like you're spending less, which you are over time, but it, it looks like you're spending less up front when you're not. But anyway, I did the month by month option just because I didn't know if I would be using this over time. But if you're ever, if you're dedicated to this website, I would suggest that you use these options because you can, it'll be cheaper for you in the long run. Premium plus, here's the prices for that. I actually do not know what you get with premium plus that makes it that expensive because, um, it doesn't say right here on this page. Yeah, here's what you get over here. Let me move my camera. And I'll let y'all scroll down and pause. If you want to see exactly what you get with a free, uh, free and premium option. So basically, you pretty much have to pay for this website to be worth it. Um, I would suggest just get the regular premium because you pretty much get all the features except for uh, the tutoring. Let's go back to the regular camera and give y'all my final opinions. Overall, I like I like this website. I think it's the closest website that you can get fluent in. I mean, you have everything you need. 
you have reading, you have tutoring, you have grammar, all in one place. So if there was one resource, if you could only use one resource, um, I would recommend this website. Uh, there's some things I don't like though. One thing I don't like is that you can't that you can't have a Spanish definition or have a definition in your target language on this website. Oh, uh, another thing I don't like is the price, and it's kind of expensive over time. I mean, the cheapest option you can get is twelve ninety nine per month, and they don't have a student discount. So yeah, but overall, it's a it's a great website. Um, I've been following Steve Kaufman for a long time. He gave me motivation to learn a language back when I was twelve, and he has the same message since. The same tips to learn a language. He always kept it honest, kept it real about it takes time to learn a language, not like other people with the one month to three months. So that's why I really clung on to his content and I still watch him to this day. So thank you, Steve Kaufman. Um, watch your videos. I wouldn't have been be where I'm at right now with Spanish. But yeah, I recommend everybody use a link website. Be sure to check out my podcast where I talk about languages and language news. It's available on six platforms right now, and all my social media links will be in the description. Thank you for watching.